Hello, welcome back to the channel. Today, um, we are doing yet another episode of, I guess we'll talk about it. Today's episode, we are going to be talking about, I have a bone to pick with you before I begin. As of the last 28 days, which in the past 28 days, I've got a lot of views on my videos, 92.1% of people are not subscribed. So just before we even begin, click subscribe, click like if you like the video, um, leave a comment down below, um, give your thoughts on what I'm about to talk about. But today's topic is kind of a versus, it's kind of a battle. Burnout versus losing passion. Uh, two things that plague artistic minds, that plague creative minds, or just plague people in general at work or anything they do really. So first I wanna start out with burnout. What is burnout? Personally, I define burnout as the need to take a break from going go, 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 on and on and on. I know right now I'm kind of burnt out from school and I'm kind of ready for the semester to be over. We only have a month left. Right now we have 33 days, I believe, or 34, and then it's over. Now compare that to losing passion. What is losing passion? I define that as you get worn out from doing something to the point that you give up even doing it or you just stop doing it. I think at some point in our life, and if you haven't already, you're going to lose passion for something. I have personally lost passion countless times and I've been burnt out countless times. I'm burnt out right now. In cases of me being burning out that aren't school, I remember I used to play basketball. I would get burnt out playing basketball by the end of the season. I've been burnt out on YouTube before. But I think on YouTube, more or less, I've been burnt out on my passion from doing YouTube. I've lost my passion countless times when it comes to doing YouTube. First thing that comes to my mind is an old is an old YouTube channel I used to have. It's only ended just a couple months ago. It's a YouTube channel that I spent a lot of time on. But I lost my passion countless times because I would make a, an amazing video. I would edit it up, take hours editing it. Like sometimes it would take up to four hours. I remember one night I was up from I think 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. editing a video to the best of my ability. And I dropped it. And as of today, I believe it's only sitting on around 60 views. And that just, it crushes somebody. It crushes you. And for that reason, I was burnt out from making YouTube videos on that channel. And it happened numerous times because I would spend so much time making these videos and editing them and I'd put them out and then they wouldn't get any views. What kind of inspired me to make this video is last night I was on a discord call just kind of talking after making a gaming video on Gmod and uh, we have a friend his name is James and he has a YouTube channel and you know I tend to track it because I used to edit videos for him I made a few videos for him and I used to make some thumbnails for him so I like to keep up with the guy you know I love James I love to see what he's doing on his channel so he went and just check on the channel and it was wiped clean there were no videos there were no live streams no playlist uh, the about page was different the name was different it went from yevo devo to official Jameis. uh we said jamias the whole time we were just reading it wrong i believe it's Jameis or james i don't know it was gone and this is where i kind of shift the focus from me here to the footage that i filmed last night as we were going down the rabbit hole of figuring out was james hacked where did his channel go what happened and we got to the bottom of it what is going on it probably just what happened the hell? what is flirting with different races i mean it's who? literally the type Why? of i don't know who this is Who's Jamias? it's the type of video that he would make this is a james this is a james i want to call him i don't know if i should though all of his lives are gone his playlists are gone his community tab is gone his channels are gone his about tab his is different gone. it's just all jamias and shifty buckets on snapchat this is not him. And this video was uploaded 37 minutes ago. I need to call him, and I think I will. What? I think I will call him. So after a bit of digging, I decided that it's time to call James, because at this point, we were thinking, he got hacked, and all of his videos are gone, because I know James. He worked long hours on this channel. This was his passion. This was his baby. He put so much time and effort into it, and he got it up to 2.3K subscribers. He got over 500,000 views on this thing. So... I was thinking James wouldn't just drop it, would he? So I call him. He wouldn't give his. He just dropped like a huge video. He did a. He did like a little like goofy collaboration with another guy, with another YouTuber. He wouldn't just give it up like this. I'm gonna call him. I'm reporting this if it's not him, bro. Come on, James, pick up, man. Please, just pick oh, what up. What if they killed him? <laughs> they, they, they killed James. No. He's not picking up. I know James. He did not do this. Okay. He's com I'm, coming I'm out on, with vids since three weeks ago. I'm on a call with him. Bro, 
and to my surprise what's, what's going on with your youtube channel i sold it yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. That is not me. I definitely sold it. Oh okay. He sold the channel to somebody. Everything was gone. He sold the channel as in he would get the login, he would get the subscribers, and James would never make a video on that channel again. And it blew my mind. I was shocked that he would do that. So he continued to talk to me, continued to talk to me, and then he told me the reason why he sold the channel. I was on a call with and we was like, James wouldn't just, he wouldn't just dip like this or he wouldn't just get hacked. Dude, I was like worried. Nah, if, if I got hacked, bro, I'd, just, I'd probably just quit. But I already decided I was done anyway, so I'm like, you know what? <sighs> you dropped a banger the other day. I thought you were going to keep going. Ah. But then again, it's like, I want to do stuff outside of like, outside of that stuff. But I might do like other videos and stuff like that. Like, yeah. You just don't want to do like the full thing. I get that. I don't really like it. Like, I lost my passion. I get it. I lost it a long time ago. Then it came back and then I lost it. And then it came back and I lost it. Simple. He lost his passion. And then in there, in the blink of an eye, five days ago, he released an amazing video where he FaceTimed a popular YouTuber and just trolled him to a couple days later, realizing that this just wasn't for him. And he sold the channel. And just like that, he lost his passion. I was just, I'm just calling to make sure that you wasn't hacked because I was like worried. I was like, this dude, everything's gone. Bro, that would be so depressing, bro. <laughs> I was like, just looking up your channel and he was like, wait, wait, this isn't, this is not Jay, this is <laughs> a official Jameis. And I was like, what do you mean? And I went and I was like, what? I was like, ain't no way. And then I seen the recent video and I was like, flirting with different races. This doesn't look like my James that I know. I was, I was scared, I was scared to death. So it just comes to show that losing your passion can be a good thing. Because I know that James is going to find something that he's good at. He even told me that he wanted to not just, like, not make YouTube videos, but move to some other outlets of content or media. I, I know this man is an artist, and I respect him for it, and I hope that he finds um, what he's good at. And I hope he finds his passion, and I hope you do as well. So thank you for watching. I just wanted to tell this little story about how losing passion is a thing and how it's different from burnout and how my friend James lost passion and just like that, his world got flipped upside down. So thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. I know it, I, I'll be honest. I enjoyed the... Yeah, both they both videos. I thought they were kind of fun. Nah, yeah, I thought they were funny. Yeah, they are. I miss, they him, already. I miss him already. I miss him already. That's so sad. Oh, I'm hurt now. I feel bad for him. He just lost the, lost. It. He like bought a MacBook and everything. I guess he's gonna start making music though, because he's on FL Studio right now.